All right, so that's the, that's the garage, how we got in. There's a garage code here. It's a two-car garage, water heater, and the air conditioning unit. And there's Kendra, <laughs> photobombing. <laughs> and then there's the keypad to get into the garage. And then here's the walkway, very nicely manicured lawn, landscaping. Nice neighborhood, too. Here's the neighborhood. Here's your car. And neighborhood. Okay, and then here's the, there's Kendra again. <laughs> All right, here's the front door. Nice kind of rusty, cranberry-ish color. You walk in. And directly to the left, here's an area that could actually be your office space. Okay. And that's a good size room. I should take a tape measure and measure it. Okay, and here's kind of the entrance way. And then to the right, and unfortunately, <laughs> <laughs> unfortunately, this is all carpeted, which mama hates, but it's nice and bright light, lots of light in here. This is a formal dining room based on the light. And then you come in and there's the kitchen over there. We'll go into it in a minute. And then this is kind of like a living room area. And then over here is a hall closet. Let's see, hall closet. The people are moving out. They're um, legally in here. Their lease doesn't end until the 18th, but they bought a house, so they're moving out now. So this is the second largest room, and it's got a little, oh, a good size walk-in closet. Okay, walk-in closet. And I'll have to take the measurements of this room, but it is the second largest room. Okay, and then this is a bathroom right outside the room. get me in it. Okay. That's that. And then here's the rest of it. Okay. And then you go back out here and <laughs> there's the kitchen and there's lots of windows over here. Nice patio outside. Not a bad sized patio. And then you go over here. This is the master. Nice and bright and light. So you have this little corner area and a sliding door out to the patio. And then this is the room itself. Really good sized room, big room. Okay, and then you go in here and there's a closet. And there is no light? Why is there no light? Your light. Okay, there it is. All right, so you have a little water closet there, and you have a sink and a mirror over there, and another sink and a mirror over there, and a tub, the poogie tub, and the shower, and then a really good size walk-in closet. Big closet. Some shelves up there, too. And actually, a light in here. Ta da! Okay, so that's that. There's your shower. There's your tub. There's the vanity, vanity, water closet, and a little extra linen closet there. Okay, so now. All right, so now, oh, let me show you part of the yard. There's the, the patio, and there's the yard back there. And they do have a sloping fence. That would be a DIY project, I guess. There's some more of the yard from the master bedroom. Okay, so now we're going out to the living area again. Say hi, Kendra. <laughs> So this is kind of like an eat-in kitchen, so you might be able to get the round table in there and or on the
on the patio. And then here's the kitchen. They had kids, so they get fenced off. And lots of cabinets. Mm -hmm. There's a count sink. And they don't have, you know, stainless steel appliances, but, oh, well, they do. They have a stainless steel refrigerator, da da, one. <laughs> and then more cabinets, more cabinets, more cabinets, and a little pantry. So this is cool. This has a lot of space. Now, off the kitchen is a laundry room. And there's a sink in here. This is very cool. And cabinets. And I don't, I think the washer dryer may come with it. It didn't say on the MLS. This goes out to the garage again. Okay, but um, that's it. Pantry, how do I get out of here? Kitchen. Okay, and then on this side, you have the other two bedrooms and a bathroom to share with double sinks and a tub. And then this goes directly into one room and there is a closet and then the door to the hallway. And then this is a little closet in here, extra closet space. Okay, and then this is the other room. This room is slightly larger. And then there's the closet. So the girls could have the two rooms on this side and share that bathroom with a double vanity, or double sink vanity. And then they're on this side, and the kitchen, and then in the master bedroom, and the other bedroom with the bath is on the other side. And then, once again, this is like the living area, all of this. Okay. Lots of room. And front door formal dining room, and this extra room that could be a wonderful office away from the TV sound and everything. Okay, so that's it. They're moving out, so it will be cleaned up and available. The only downer is that it's carpeted throughout most of the, I mean, the kitchen, laundry room, bathrooms, and little eating dining room are tile, but everything else is carpeting. And this is, um, this is old. <laughs> this is Old Dock Road, right? Yeah. Okay, so the address is 13521 Old Dock Road, and it is um, a four-bedroom, three-bath with 2,457 square feet, all one story, and it is $1,750 a month in rent. So that's it. We think this one might be the winner, but we're going to go see two more, and we'll let you know. Okay, bye!